Hey YouTubers, Shell Sullivan here and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to test the sensitivity of my homemade flash powder to impact. Uh, in other words, I'm going to hit it with a hammer and see if it'll explode. Please don't ever try what you see done on my videos. I do these videos to entertain and educate. They're not for you to emulate. So please do not try this at home. Okay, the idea is to I'm gonna um, measure out very tiny amounts of flash on this piece of paper. I'm gonna trap that flash between a piece of paper and some tape. Give me a nice flat something I can hit with the hammer. Yeah, 0 0.04. That's that's a pretty tiny amount there. Um, I think it's safe to make a little popper out of that. So we'll we'll try that. See how that works. And there, I don't know if you can see it, but. That amount of flash is about that much. Trapped between this paper and that piece of tape. I'll cut it out. Maybe I should leave a little tab on it so I can get to stay on the hammer. All right, so there you go. Now, I've already done this a bunch of times and sometimes I've gotten a little much this is probably like 0.07, and this one's probably like 0.04. This one's kind of big here. That's probably must that might um, that one must be be a tenth of a gram, and that one's about so big. That one's kind of elongated. So they all probably have between point, point 0.1 and 0 0.04. I'm going to start with a small one here. That one's probably 0 0.03, 0 0.04. Okay, here it goes. <laughs> it took me a couple tries, but I got it. Neat. Nice. Stick to my hammer, but that's probably okay. Oh. That one sort of misfired. Oh. All right, that one's kind of thick there. It didn't look big, but it's thick in the middle. So that was probably 0 0.07, 0 0.08. Oh, I felt the shock wave off of that one. That's another one about that size, 0 0.07, 0 0.08. Oh, <laughs> All right, here's that big one. And, you know, that shows you that that flash is pretty sensitive. So any type of friction, impact, uh, I need to test it with some sparks. I've tested it with a, uh, a barbecue igniter and it wouldn't light it. But I think something with a bit more amps behind it probably would. But there you go, impact sensitivity test on the homemade flash powder. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, then please give me a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. If you think a friend might like to check it out, then please share it. If, if you have comments, questions, or suggestions, they go down below in the comments. And subscribe to my channel, but only if you think... earned it. In the next one. And subscribe to my channel. But don't know if you think